wait, wait, wait. Welcome to the History Hunters channel here on YouTube. Nice of you to drop in and look at some of my adventures. And um, most of my material is about the Second World War, uh, metal detecting the relics and searching for history and locations from that time frame. So today I'm at the location which has been extensively used by the Germans during the Second World War. They were here for several years and it was a major complex uh, where they had a lot of strategic uh, positions and uh, all kinds of equipment. So it's uh, almost a weekend and uh, I have some spare time so why not go out and uh, move yourself in the nature and uh, see what history will bring out today quite wet here in some of the areas and um, first object of the day who would know what that could be looks like some sort of handle so I'm not too sure whether there are yeah there are some more signals down there well, probably just a lot of rubble I'll check that out and see if that's something interesting this here is just a curiosity but you know there's a round hole in the rock here and it's been filled with a metal object so it's been a rod and it's probably one of the rods which they threaded the barbed wire through to make a defense perimeter of this area seems like a little hole here and I do think I saw a cartridge what is it? no it's not a cartridge it's a uh, Actually an item, a piece of something. That is really weird. It looks like a cartridge on that end, but it could be a flattened cartridge. I'll clean it up and see what I can make out of it. I'm at this strange little spot. And I got this thing here. Looks like a cup. It's a piece for a bicycle bell. What is it? Very fine, spheric, and uh, hmm, strange. Uh, seems like this hole has another surprise. This looks like a battery, a single cell battery, and it's actually paper on the outside, and it's totally rotten. It's gone, but. Um, you can see the contours and the um, sort of uh, look of it. Cool. Got this box here. Doesn't look like too much, but it's actually the box for the Sunders or the, uh, um, what do you call it, the uh, fuses for the mines, the S mines. So there's a top and a bottom. I'm not sure which one this is. Let's see if we can find the other one. Quite a lot of small pieces here. This is a one cell battery, a very small one. And I have this thing here. Uh, I'm not sure what that could be. Some sort of uh, connector with uh, maybe a strap on it. Okay. I just came through the forest here and this one turns up I'm afraid to think I know what it is and um, but uh, wow is that what I think it is is that really what I think it is I can't believe it if it is this is one hell of a find this is the nozzle it absolutely is. Look at that. This must be, no, is it rusted or is it? This is definitely a nozzle. And this sort of um, shape here is very, 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 very familiar to a flamethrower. Um, I'm not too sure. But this is really, 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 really interesting. And uh, could it be that this has been a surface 
laying here on the surface all the way since the Second World War. That is almost unbelievable. Looks very, very much like a flamethrower. I'm not sure about the type, but I'm going to check that out on the internet. Um, there's a handle, and there's another handle. There's a hole here. Not too sure. Yeah, this has. This is really some sort of construction, and I do believe that that is a nozzle. Must be a nozzle for the flamethrower. I'm not sure what they're called, but I'm definitely gonna check that out. If it is, this is finding of a lifetime. You only find one of these in your whole life, that's for sure. That's about what I had time for today. Excellent little trip, not too much to find, but the last item there, what can I say? Must be one of the most terrific surface finds I ever done in my life. So, thanks for watching and thanks for giving me comments and uh, giving me the thumbs up on my channel. I really appreciate that. Until next time, I'll see you later and have a nice day.